five Capricorns is the high priestess with your general tarot reading. It's general, so if it resonates with you, leave me some comments, like, share, and subscribe to the Chrome Free channel. I would appreciate it, okay? And happy New Year's to everyone, okay? Happy New Year's, Capricorns. Make sure y'all tap that bell so y'all know when I go live. I was live last night. Where were y'all? Now when I live. Well, some of y'all was. I can't even front, Capricorn. Shout out to you. Um, and y'all follow, make sure y'all follow me on my social sites and make sure y'all like shopping with the Crohn's, getting your manifestation candles, okay? Y'all know they come charged up and everything. And I'm about to take these candles up a notch, okay? Because I said they're a little bit, they're a little bit plain, even though they come with crystals. I'm gonna have to even put more stuff in it. Okay, yes. So yeah, y'all make sure y'all tap that bell and um, subscribe if you haven't. Okay, Capricorn. So this is for Capricorn. So I'm going to the Venus placements. And there's already some cards that fell down. It's about four cards. Let's see what these are. All upright. So let's see. Hermit, the page, the ace of pentacle, the page of wine, and the queen of sword. So I feel like some of y'all, uh, Cat, some of y'all feel like, some of y'all feel like either you pulled away from people and I feel like because you pulled away from people, now you got the, the energy and you can think clearly and I feel like um, you're able to move forward and I feel like it's opportunities that is are, are about to present themselves to you. But others of you, I feel like you may need to pull away for an opportunity that could be in, in a way of you like um, really moving forward or um having clarity okay some of y'all have like someone that's in your way energetically that you need to pull away from temperance is here sagittarius energy so for some of y'all y'all some of y'all could be about to like go away and study okay go away to school and study some of y'all could be uh um contemplating on if you want to go to school to study or asking yourself um trying to figure out what it is that you want to study okay because I feel like some of you just ace of pentacles. Some of y'all trying to get to the bag. As a Capricorn always is, some of y'all really trying to figure out what you can do to get to the bag. And I feel like with temperance, you're taking your time, okay? You're taking your time because you want the best outcome, okay? And these cards kind of went sideways, but, but okay, is the lovers, the ace of swords, the ace of wands, and the fool. So it's beginnings to here. And these elevens is right by each other. So definitely... Uh, creative energy the lovers here opportunity for like love affairs opportunity and like opportunities like in businesses like doors is opening for you right now and i really feel like you need to like take a leap of faith okay the fool is here y'all need to take a leap of faith like the fool is here and then here's the gateway the two the two aces meaning it only takes thought and action thought and action for you for the love of your life, the career of your life, the opportunity of your life, all it takes for you to take that leap of faith through <laughs> through the gateway. It's open for you right now. And I feel like with the queen of swords here, some of y'all could be hesitant with your energy. But I feel like you're going to be back. The ace, This ace of pentacles behind your back, another ace. So 111 is definitely a message. More creative energy. Even more creative. Meaning like, and with the queen of swords here, Whatever you think about right now, you are creating. So you need to be extremely careful with your energy, who you will let around you, and what you're thinking about. Because as you think right now, you are creating, Capricorn. So I feel like create your life the way that you want it to be. Be free with it, okay? Because it's the fool. Meaning you, whatever it is that you think and write out or what is is about to happen for you you about to create that you, right now this is like a, a quantum field that's open for you right now six of swords at the bottom it's about moving away from whatever is not letting you have like a peaceful mind or a peaceful home if it's not peaceful you need to let it go anything that's making you feel riled up or has you like um out of it in any way you need to release that okay hermit is here hermit is about focus focus on you mainly you okay the focus right now is on you and what it is that you want so if it ain't serving you you need to let it go 
the world. You done came through some cycles and completions. Eight of Wands is here. So whatever it is that you focused on, whatever it is that you taking classes in is, is going to definitely get you, take you far. Some of y'all is going to be rewarded very nicely with the world. Okay. Some of y'all even about to travel the world. <clears throat> Excuse me, my third position, that's confirmation, okay? Some of y'all about to travel. Some of y'all is about to be traveling, okay? Will of Fortune is here. So Fortune is here for you and the Emperor. Some of y'all is about to be big bosses, like open businesses. I feel like some of y'all is going to be fortunate um, coming into money, coming into inheritances. King of Cup, Queen of Cups is in reverse and the Ten of Pentacles is in reverse. Ooh. So I feel like uh, with the Queen of Cups in reverse, some of y'all feel like need to uh, stay out of your emotions because I really feel like right now being in your emotions right now is uh, going to be a drain to your finances currently and in the future. I feel like the more you try to, the more you don't have control of your emotions and because I really feel like right now you need to focus. You got the Ace of Swords. You need to be extremely careful about where your attention is going right now. You, you Queen of Swords energy, be extremely careful about what you focus on. Be extremely careful that you're not giving in to ill emotions because they are directly going to make your finances plummet. Okay? Eight of Cups. If it ain't serving you, let it go. And have no, no thought about it. I feel like some of y'all need to be like the emperor with this will of fortune and know when it's time to move on, okay? Don't carry hurt and heavy emotions over things that it is time to, to be released from, okay? Let it go and keep it moving. What other messages? i seen the empress in the deck, okay? King of Pentacles, okay? Prosperity, abundance. Prosperity and abundance, I feel like. And I feel like for some of you, you could even be uh, wanting to uh, go to school for some type of like carpentry. Some of y'all want to even like um, like uh, study like the occult. But I feel like whatever it is that you do, I feel like put your all into it and be serious about it like it's your business, okay? Like, I feel like do it like it's your business. Treat. Matter of fact, I feel like with the King of Pentacles and the Emperor out the debt, that's Aries energy. Who else is here? Aries, Gemini. Uh, I feel like in a Virgo is here. So I really feel like you really need to be, uh, take your, you need to be serious, treat yourself as a business, okay? So I feel like don't deal with people that don't, respect your business okay if they if they wouldn't go into an establishment and act or do those things you don't accept that okay and that's for personal relationships and business let me pull some oracles divine feminine i feel like some of y'all is going to be getting married okay divine feminine came out so and some of you need to even be more into more tech tap more into your divine feminine okay because queen of swords is here king of pentacles the emperor even though the queen of swords is a queen like she still is not a soft queen so it's like some of y'all need to tap into the divine feminine and even if you're a masculine man you need to tap into that divine feminine because it's all about that divine feminine is that nurturer because wasn't did the empress come out no i had just seen it in a deck so that means you need to work on like caring being caring and nurturing like a mother or like feminine like embracing that feminine divine feminine though divine feminine is that uh to my exp explanation would be someone that is in in tune with their masculine and feminine energies okay let me pull some oracles, okay? You're not afraid to express if you're down or you're not holding back. Lobster, financial pinch. So I feel like financial pinch went right over here where the Queen of Cups is. So I really feel like some of you will like, it's like you're going to experience or continue to experience if you have. I feel like some of you could have experience of financial pinch and it's only due to like the spiraling down of your emotions. Okay, so it's really about like um, standing firm, like handling yourself like a business. A business doesn't get upset when someone outside of them 
is is acting like un not the unaccordingly. Okay, so it's like handle yourself like a business, and other people will handle you like a business. Once you in this emperor energy, okay, Aries. Aries is the war god. Don't play serious, okay? Passionate about passionate about the, the greater good of everyone, not just looking out for himself and in his feelings because you're hurt about what a person said or done to you. It's not about that. It's about seeing a bigger picture, handling yourself from uh like a business perspective. You're not letting small things get to you. You you want to build up your business, okay? You you want to control like uh your emotions versus letting outside people like p take jabs or like have like privy over like you or control over you basically okay capricorn so those are your messages okay leave me some comments like share and subscribe to the crones way channel i'll be back with your general tarot reading and i feel like for some of you i feel like some of y'all i just need to say some of y'all feel like it's about to um have like your divine partner come in, divine feminine partner come in. So I feel like I see the lover. So it could be divine feminine or masculine. Even though it says feminine, I feel like a divine partner because the lover is out. Okay. And it's next to the ace of wands in the fool. So I feel like some of y'all, I feel like um, once you take a leaf of faith, you are going to be meeting like divine partners and things like that. Okay, Cap okay Capricorn. So See y'all next week. Make sure y'all follow me on my social sites if you are not. And um, shop with the Chrome Manifestation Candles and the Crystals. All right. See y'all.